Mayor, tell me what happened. How did this come to be? Well, everyone on the town bank board has been, has been following very closely the developments at Virginia Beach. I've had a series of discussions with uh, Bob Aston, the president of town bank, and we have agreed that it's in the best interest of the bank and for me and for the city to, uh, to separate at this time, for me to step off the uh, board at town bank to avoid any appearance of any conflict of interest going forward. Now that we're looking at it in hindsight, the fact that there were elected public officials on the board to begin with, in hindsight, of course, this yeah. is the first time. Yeah. Do, do you think it creates the atmosphere that this can happen? Um, <clears throat> I'm not sure. There's been a long tradition of government or elected officials serving on the boards, of, especially of community banks, mm -hmm. of larger banks. Most of my predecessors as mayor of Norfolk did. But we live in a different age, and there is a lot of financial, I mean, complicated, uh, you know, uh, things that come in front of the city council. The town bank is growing. And so, um, you know, th it's with the press, the scrutiny that we're going through, the, the notion that we want to be as transparent as possible, uh, we just thought it was the best thing uh, for me and for Linda to just step off the board at this time so no one can even question uh, a possible conflict of interest, of interest or the appearance of one. Did you call Linda and say, hey, and let me make sure I understand, can you tell me the conversation you had with Linda, with Mayor Johnson about this? Well, the conversation really started with, uh, with Mr. Aston, and then... Um, and for the record, did he ask you to step down, or how would you like to uh, explain uh, that? I'd, I'd like to say that we agreed that it was in the best interest of the bank and in the best interest of the city of Norfolk, and quite honestly, it uncomplicates my life, you mm -hmm. know, to uh, not have to do this any, any longer. And so, I mean, we, we reached that agreement. Uh, I have, you know, my good friend Will Sessoms mm -hmm. is, uh, is having a very difficult time now. And we just want to try to avoid any notion that other board members of Town Bank might have any conflict of interest or even, or even the, the perception may, may appear. How do you handle this? How do you handle not having a, an appearance of conflict of interest? How do you, what is, well, your, what is your standard operating procedure? Well, we scrutinize the agenda closely. Um, the town bank um, um, presence in Norfolk is not nearly as large as it is in some of the other cities. And so I, you know, examine the agenda pretty, pretty uh, uh, carefully. But do you know if these people have loans with town bank and you're on the board of town bank? Well, that's, that's one of the issues that a lot of them come to us in LLCs. Sometimes these loans originate in other cities in which I have no knowledge. I mean, there are all types of, you know, of confusing types of issues that come in front of the, the council. And I have never uh, knowingly violated any conflict of interest statutes. No, yeah, that, and um, this just is going to clear the air now. I won't ever have that question. That was one of my questions is, have you ever knowingly voted for a project knowing that they have a town bank loan? No. Of course not. Ever. Ever. And do you think there's a difference between you and Will Sessom's position with Town Bank? Obviously, because he is an employee. Does yeah, it make I mean, a difference? that's going to be for somebody else to decide. I think we're both governed by the same conflict of interest mm -hmm. uh, rules. But you don't, you don't know of any conflict of interest you might have. If they start looking into your past and the votes that you've made, will they find anything? Uh, look, I have never knowingly voted <clears throat> in any, on any issue that would violate a conflict of interest. Knowingly, but have you? <laughs> Not knowingly. Uh, Andy, how could I admit, how could I, to the best of my knowledge, I have never uh, voted uh, in a, on a matter that would involve a conflict of interest for me under any set of circumstances. You're good friends with Will Sessoms. You all have supported candidates together. You've all had questionable press together. How pained are you because of what's happened to your friend? Oh, I, you know, I care very much uh, for Will. I think he is a great public servant, and I think everyone who knows him feels badly about that. Tough question. Should he resign as mayor? Oh, I'm not going to go into that. Thank you. Um, oh, and the last question I'd like to ask you about the way the board is set up. Did Bob Aston tell you that other 
elected officials be leaving the board as well? No, he didn't say that. Just the mayors? I think that's as far as he's gotten. So yeah, mm -hmm. I think just the mayors right now. Does this hurt town bank? I don't think so. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Does this affect the deal with the Richmond Bank in January? The oh, I don't think so. You don't think so? Okay. Is there anything you'd like to add? No, that you can stop any time. <laughs> 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 I can see you searching your mind. I no. understand. Okay. Uh, did you have any questions? A uh, little uh, two shot here, but um, when did you first come to the realization as a group? I'm assuming it's clear to s it's correct to say Bob and the two mayors agreed mutually that it was the best to leave. When was that decision made? R recently. Like today? Oh, I mean, I'd say recently. Okay. An hour ago? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No. Um, uh, we're in a different, uh, and roll, roll on this, we're in a different climate now. Tell me about the different climate. Well, I, you know. It's been a wake-up uh, call, the McDonald well, trial. Social media, you know, I don't want to mm. get into all of that stuff. But, I mean, transparency is very important. And um, We're in a different in, time. Uh, we are. People can touch you immediately. They want answers immediately. And everything's up on the Internet. I mean, it's. We are in a different age, and I and I sense it. And we've learned we're learning from the experience that's happening at Virginia Beach, mm -hmm. and so that's why you know for the most part I've taken this action. Have you had any conversation with Will Sussums? No. Mm 